popular bar is expanding into the restaurant scene. Owner of Station Bar and Lounge, Blaine Nishizawa, as well as Chef Solomon X. Calhoun, here to talk about Osoyami Restaurant. Good morning to both of you. Morning. As well as Emmy Hart. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> so let's talk, since we have all of this food out in front of us, let's just dive right in and talk a little bit about uh, what, you, what you offer. Well, we kind of specialize in, uh, I guess you could say, like gourmet sliders. Mm -hmm. So we have uh, 12 different uh, sliders on the menu. Uh, we also have a uh, fun little play on fries and some of our signature things here, like the fried kimchi, and we have a cheesy sriracha balls. And talk about that uh, going from uh, restaurant uh, barn bar scene to the restaurant business. Well, I come from that. Um, you know, I've been working in the restaurant industry for about 15 years now, and uh, opening Station Bar and Lounge, which is kind of my little uh, venue, music venue. Um, then I kind of wanted to have a little bit of food involved as well. So I know Solomon from uh, from working at. Uh, at a place in Waikiki, and we kind of came together, and this is what we came up with. So, Solomon, talk a little bit about what it, what's appealing to folks when they come in. Uh, talk about sliders, gourmet sliders. What are people liking? Well, uh, they really like the the locomoco slider here. Um, it's almost exactly like a locomoco without the rice, uh, uh, frazzled onions, egg, green onion. Uh, demi glazed gla gravy. And so, are these any of these designed to? Uh, I, I don't know. Pair up with what people are drinking, and uh, do you do you think of something? This would go really good with with uh, things that are popular. Uh, we have a lychee cooler on special right now. Um, that's one of our drink specials, and it goes good with pretty much any of this. It's a a sweet lychee. Um, what's the Maybe it's rum. Rum. <laughs> Catch you rum. <laughs> All right, Emmy, let's talk a little bit about the, what are you hearing? Uh, so they're hot and new on Yelp. So they're on fire on Yelp. And they're 42, they've got 42 reviews and they're four and a half stars. And Yelpers recommend that you go there during happy hour. And it's really interesting because they are kind of embedded in the neighborhood. Um, so they're parallel in, in, um, to uh, King Street. Mm -hmm. So you just got to use your Yelp map to find that that place, but happy hour is where it's at here. We haven't talked about exactly where you are. Maybe you could describe how folks can get to you. Well, we're actually um, right in back of Allen Wong's. So if you know where Allen Wong's is on King Street, we're at the back side of the block. But if you're coming up McCulley, right before you hit King, you hang a left and we're a block and a half in. That's pretty much the <laughs> easiest way to describe it. Emmy mentioned the happy hour, so that's a, that's a big draw. Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, it's a literal happy hour. Uh, it's um, six days of the week. We open from uh, 6 p.m. and it's until 7 p.m. And um, you get to basically choose one of our sliders that we have offered and it gives you a basket of fries to go along with that. So it's kind of like an awesome extra value meal. <laughs> right. okay. Well, thanks for sharing these awesome extra value meals with us and talking a little bit about uh, what's new in Honolulu. Thanks for coming in this morning. Cool. Thank, Thank you. you. And you can always check out this interview again on our website. Just head to KITV.com.